Gina, the person you're about to meet asked she not be identified because she has concerns about the international reach and perhaps to the people who may be involved. All she wanted was a puppy, which she got, but she also has a lot of questions. When news of 28 French bulldog puppies were found inside a hot moving van in Texarkana, one dead, four more that later died, the pair of van drivers arrested, it got this Houston area woman's attention. These dogs came from Ukraine, like what the heck? It sounded familiar, the puppies imported to the U.S. from Ukraine, the French bulldog puppy she bought from a seller west of Houston four months ago, had a pet passport from Ukraine, and the name of the owner on the pedigree certificate she recently received. The guy that was on, that was arrested, that's his name. The drivers arrested, they faced 28 counts of animal cruelty, but the attorney for one of the Houston area drivers says no charges have been filed yet. Because of that, we're not identifying them. But the owner questions what else is on the paperwork she was given. And then if you see at the top, this is the microchip number right. for this dog. This is the microchip number the vet gave me, and this is the microchip number on the passport. She paid $2,800 for the puppy that's now part of the family. Healthy now, but when she first arrived home, like the rescued pups, she was diagnosed with medical issues. But this is just a month and a half of all the times that she's had to go to the vet. It was a search for a French bulldog on Craigslist that led her to the puppy she calls Harley. But she's also learned a lesson she recommends for all pet buyers. I would definitely make sure you see the parents on site, for sure. That's the one thing. That, that and you do not walk away without papers.